So Les, I heard that you tried out an experimental thing with your rifle at this match. What, ha what were you doing? Well, I went with a hydraulic buffer in my DMR, mm -hmm. and uh, the results were somewhat less than optimal. So, uh, so we've talked about this with what stoners do. People ask, like, why not hydraulic buffer? And I have a hydraulic buffer, and I've always been like, because they're highly unreliable failure points. Definitely. What happened to you? Well, yesterday on the sniper spinner stage, I got one round off, and then it was double feel feeding, and it was a nasty double feed, so... The extra, uh, clearing the malfunction took forever. Mm -hmm. And then I repeated the same exercise three more times and just timed out. Um, when the sun came up and I went and did the Casarda drill, everything warmed up, ran great. It was awesome. It was a great stage. And then this morning over on the Folda Gap, exact same problem and timed out clearing all the malfunctions. So it seems to be based on the ambient temperature and the results. Your hydraulic buffer was actually working differently based on temperature. Exactly. <laughs> hydraulic buffers are only for super gamer guns. They're not really reliable. 